Okay, so a lot of the homemade recipes we make, like the dish detergent that I'm about to make, uses what is called washing soda. Washing soda is not the same thing as regular baking soda. I did a little research on this and um, realized that you can actually make your own at home. So I'm going to make it and bring you along with me, and then I'm going to be making dish soap. Okay, this is what it looks like before. It's just plain old baking soda. You can see it clumps up a lot. And after I turn it into washing soda, it changes the chemical composition of it and it's not supposed to clump up. So I'm gonna break up some of these larger clumps here. And um, I may have too much in this pan. It's a 15 inch saucepan, but uh, I'm gonna store it in this um, half gallon jar. So that's, that's how much I put in here. And I'm going to store it in there and I'm done. So we break these up and then I'll put it in the oven and then I'm going to start every 20 minutes. So I'll start twice while it's in there and leave it in for an hour. And we'll see what it looks like. I'll post, place a, a picture before and after and see. It's not supposed to be clumpy after so I'll put a before and after picture. Okay so this is the second time we're stirring it and you can see that the big chunks are starting to break up so I'm just going to give it a good stir. Make sure it all kind of gets cooked evenly. And another 20 minutes or so, that should be done. Those are breaking up really easily now. Okay, I think we're done. I just took it out of the oven. And the clumps are breaking up a lot easier. So um, I think it's a success. I will put all the links below that you need, like the link to Wellness Mama, where I got these exact instructions from. But there's other similar ones on other blogs. And um, I will be making the dish soap tomorrow, so I'll make that another video because I have some burgers I need to get cooking. I need this pan. It's getting late. Still a lot to do. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you later.